What's up YouTube, Enzero here, and I got an, another Yu-Gi-Oh opening. Uh, one of the very few Yu-Gi-Oh openings I will probably want to do since uh, this set came out because uh, I really like what's in it. I love the cards, I love the hero stuff, the, uh, the battle uh, wasp, I almost said battle bugs, the battle wasp archetype is a thing. Uh, a lot of good reprints that I hope I can get since I couldn't get the originals so uh, yeah I want all the Elemental Hero Stratos cards that I can get because uh, that's one of my favorite heroes of all time so uh, yeah this box is pretty damaged but Mail delivery is not the best it should have been. And I'm pretty sure the secret rare is on top, so I'll do it uh, the way that uh, most openings do with these ones. Top card on the bottom. Alright. Vision Hero Multiply Guy. White Dragon Wave Burster. Battle Wasp. Halibut the Charge, Salomon Great Sanctuary, it looks really good as a Ultra, and Dino Wrestler Pankratop, sweet. I mean, I'm the kind of guy that, that gets uh, the common version and use that, but it doesn't hurt to have a, if your first copy is a secret rare. Element Hero Absolute Zero, one of my favorite all-time cards. Gingerbread House, Shadal Falco, Element Hero Stratos, sweet. That's one. I want every pack to have a Stratos. Not gonna lie. And our secret is Imperia, the one from that character of Gansley from the third season of Yu-Gi-Oh, where they go to the virtual world. And they face Kaiba's, uh, <clears throat> Kaiba's, uh, former execs, exec, executives, uh, Shadal Hedgehog, Herald of Arc Light, Vision Hero Poisoner, that one looks really cool, uh, Summon Swarm, and yes, Black Luster Soldier, Soldier of Chaos. This is an awesome secret rare. Man, this is already a good box. I know a lot of people will be, probably be using that. Just because it's a Black Luster Soldier that comes from the extra deck and not uh, from the main deck. It's pr pretty much going to be replacing uh, Bardic. I already spoiled this, so. Uh, Hama the Comor uh, Conquering Bow. Predator Blast, Fortune Fairy Anne, uh, Battle Moss, Erebalus, the Rapid Fire, and Shadog Squid Squad Mata. Pretty cool. Yeah, I think this is going to just replace, or the Blackluster Soldiers are going to replace uh, whatever rank three, or link three. All right. Uh, Vision Hero Witch Raider. Would have been cool if she was like a extra deck card, to be honest. Uh, Battle Wasp Azuz Azusa the Ghost Bow. Battle Wasp Nest. Sonic Stun. And Fortune Fairy Hikari. Which is a pretty cool card. I'm not a fan of the Fortune Fairies per se. Because I, I like the Fortune Ladies better. Their mechanic is uh, way more interesting to me. I would probably like uh, the Fortune Fairies more if they were originally their normal monsters. Like in the anime was. Because then they can probably do like a cool uh, mechanic with it. Alright. Shadal Beast. Uh, 
Battle Wasp, Ballista, the Armageddon, Lunalite, Kaleido Chick, Miracle Stone, and All Eyes, Phantom Dragon. That's pretty cool. The fact that it's a Pendulum Scale Zero is pretty interesting for some people. All right, number 26, Spaceway Octopa Octobi Pass, Fortune Fairy Who, Guardian of Order, Golden Moon Coin, and Dark Sacrifice. Uh, that's cool. I think this is valuable. I'm reading the effect, but besides hand traps, traps are really not as popular as people think. Like, there's some, but uh, hand traps just apparently are the way to go in this one, which I don't like. I probably spoiled it, but I didn't see it, so. Vision Hero Gravity Eel. Uh, Battle Wasp Twin Bow. Vision Release. Battle Wasp Sting the Poison. And Vision Hero Violent. Yes. This is, for some reason, like, I open packs that that contain this card from Dual Saga and Dual Power. And for some reason, I could not pull that card. I was debating on buying him single, but since I was ordering this box anyway, I was like, you know what, I'll just wait until after I open a couple boxes. All right, Banawas Dart the Hunter, Lunalight Crimson Fox, Fortune Fairy Chi, TG Drillfish and Salomon Great Almirage. Almirage. I think that's how you say it. That's pretty cool. Uh, definitely uh, for. Definitely run at least two in the Salomon Great deck. Man, this is a great box. I got a lot of valuable stuff. At least for me. I don't, I don't know about you, but. All right, Apparition, Will of the Sam Salomon Great, Subterra Guru, uh, Gimmick Puppet, Chimera Doll. That's interesting. Oh, that's even more interesting. It just requires two machine monsters, so uh, if you have a machine deck, it probably would help. And Cyframe Lord, Lambda. Lambda. That's cool. It only requires two monsters. Man, I'm pulling all the... This is probably a god tier box, and I ruined it. Vision Fusion. Uh, TG Metal Skeleton. Fortune Fairy Who. Black Dragon Collapse Serpent. And Destiny Hero Dangerous. I figured this should have been hollow like a while ago. Just for the fact that he's easy to make. Just use Super Poly and your Destiny Hero and steal one of somebody's dark monster that can't be destroyed by card effects. You know? Alright. Artifact Scythe. That's pretty cool. Water of Life. Fortune Fairy Swee. Vision Hero Minimum Ray. And TG Gear Zombie. I still have my TG deck. I still haven't even updated it either. That's the that's the sad part of this. I have a lot of I have three of every TG monster except for Hyper Librarian for some reason, and uh, haven't modified the deck yet. I should get around to at some point. Revival Swarm, Fortune Fairy Anne, Symbol of Friendship, apparently that's made out of permanent marker, Fortune Fairy N, and Elemental Hero Neos Knight. I traded away my Neos Knight a while ago, 
And I was like, oh, I should have kept that card. Because all it requires is a warrior, so you can super poly uh, Phantom Knights and all that stuff. Yep, I ruined it. Oh well. Artifact Lancia. Vision Hero Trinity. White Dragon Wyvern Burst. Moonlight Kaleido Chick. Salomon Great Sanctuary. Sometimes I remember to put to reveal the secret last. Sometimes I don't. Eventually it'll be force of habit. Because you never expect the secret to be on top in most sets. Acceptable results. Predoblast, Vision Hero Poisoner, Aeroblast the Rapid Fire, and another Imperia. I figured if uh, it'd be good for an Exodia deck, Imperia, since you can run three technically. Just summon, draw. Hopefully you pull an Exodia piece. Shadal Hedgehog. Vision Hero Witch Raider. Black Dragon Collapse Serpent. Sonic Stun. And Double Head Anger Double Headed Anger Knuckle for the mich uh, the trains. That's pretty cool. Magical Musketeer Max. Sweet. Another card from my Magical Musketeers. Because Casper is going to be taken forever to get. Uh, Foolish Burial. Gimmick Puppet Chimera Doll. Shadal Squad Mata. And Sky Striker Mobilize Engaged. Awesome. I have Sky Striker cards. It's just... I don't know how to run it, per se. I just you know, have the cards collected. I don't know what kind of Sky Striker build I would want to do, honestly. I almost forgot. I didn't reveal it to myself, so. Uh, Lucky Loan. Vision Hero Multiply Guy. Swarming s Summoning Swarm. Golden Moon Coin. And Necros Cycle. I'm pretty sure I can trade that away. Yeah, this I love this set. It just you know it, it it really it's a really good set in my opinion. It has everything that I want, if that's if that means anything. Number 76, Harmonizer Gridel, Herald of Arclight, Battle Boss Nest, Destiny Hero uh, Dangerous, and Sky Striker Ace Ray. Nice upgrade as far as rarity goes. Not gonna lie, I I think I like the the card as an ultra. Secrets is just too glittery for me, you know. It ruin it kind of ruins the image. Uh, Vision Hero Gravito, Apparition, uh, Battle Wasp Pin the Bullseye, Shadow Falco, and Stardust Mirage. Debated on making a junk speeder doppel Stardust build, but uh, Stardust is just too slow in this in this era of, of Yu-Gi-Oh. All right, Artifact Scythe, Revival Swarm, Elemental Hero Stratos, sweet. I'm surprised this is my second one out of this box. Uh, Dragon Necro, Nether Soul Dragon, and Vision Hero Increase. Awesome. I think I need at least one more of him to make the deck great. Just try to push everything over a little bit. So there's only like three more packs left. Wow. 
Water of Life, Shadal Beast, Vision Hero Minimum Ray, TG Drillfish, and High Speed Broid Rubber Band Shooter. Man, I'm getting all sorts of uh, secret rares. I, I think I've only have one double, and that was Imperia. Yeah, I think so. I think, yeah, Imperia is the only double so far. Uh, Battle Wasp, Ballista Armageddon, Well of Salomon Great, Fortune Fairy Chi, uh, Miracle Stone, and Cyberstein. You're supposed to have like a lot of Bill deck ideas with Cyberstein, but none that were going competitive, that's for sure. Probably because nobody's willing to pay the 5,000 life points for something that can easily be negated, you know. Uh, TG Metal Skeleton, Vision Hero Trinity, Summon Limit, that's pretty cool. Fortune Fairy Chi, or Sui, and Avenge. Avendred Savior is the last secret rare we pull. So yeah, I have no double or one double out of this uh, out of this box. Everything is different, which is really cool. This is probably the best box I've I've pulled in in out of any set really. I think I only have like two. I think this was the only double because so I pulled a lot of different stuff, like. This is a good one. This one's a good one. I finally got at least one Vion. Still need two more, but, you know. Uh, Battle Wasp, Hama, the Conquering Bow. This one's the best card I, I pulled because I love Black Lesser Soldier in general. But pulling him as the Link Monster is just even better. Got Pancratops. Yep. So I pulled a lot of different stuff. Out of 24 packs, I got 23 different, uh, 23 different secret rares, which is pretty cool, in my opinion. I think the only one that I did not get was Boral Sword, which I'm pretty sure that is uh, uh, the see the another secret rare. But other than that, that was a this was a pretty good box. I pretty much pulled like almost everything in this one thing. Now I gotta pull multiple copies of some stuff. So uh, that's the end of this video. Uh, I hope you all enjoyed this. Uh, I will get another box of this. I think two will be the max. If I get another third, it's because I got it on discount. But I highly doubt it will be discounted. I think this box will just go up in price, you know? Because there's so much good stuff in here. So, yeah. So I'll see you in the next video. Thanks for watching.